Okay, so we have save folder located here. One click on it and we get started. Okay, so this is the first screen you're gonna see showing all the worlds I have available on my save folder. Click on the first one for example. In order to get into the wallet and get all the info I have in it, enter its password. I press done when I'm done and this will get me into the wallet I chose and will open all folders and cards that I have in my wallet. And this is the main folder separated by subjects. I have many cards and folders. For example, bank accounts, business, credit cards and so forth. Let's get into credit cards for example. Okay, this is a list of all the credit cards that I have in my wallet. We have the American Express, Bank of America. Let's get into Bank of America. Click on it. These are all the fields of my bank account. One click here takes me back to the folder. Let's get into American Express. This is all the info of my American Express card. And one click on credit cards and I'm back to the folder. If I want to add an item, I have the plus button on the upper right side here of the screen. I click on it and I open a menu. I can create a new folder, new card or cancel. Let's create a new card for example. Okay, these are all the available templates in Safe Wallet. I have many different topics available. When I want to create a new card, driver license, ID card, library card, serial number, password, Okay, let's create a new contact card. I can change the card's icon, title, or different fields that I have. Okay, for example, let's create let's change the card's title. Let's create a new one, imaginary one. I click save and done. And we can see that the new card was added successfully. If I want to delete a card, I hit on the card, I hit edit first, sorry, and then delete, done, and the card is gone. If I want to edit an existing card, I click on it now, and now I click edit, and this will open all the fields that I can change within the card I chose. We can change the icon here, the title, and the different fields. Another option is adding new properties to the current card. Let's click on it. Okay, now you see I have many different kinds of field types. String, numeric, date, and so forth. Let's get back to the card. The fields, the fields editing is made by the type of the field that I chose. If I choose this field, this is the date field, I get to the date selection. If I choose a string type, for example, field, I can be I will be able to edit a string. I can also choose the icon selector here and replace our icon from within many different icons sorted by categories. This is very convenient. We have the first one, finance icons. We have the medical icons. We have the network icons. We have the personal icons, software icons and last one, transportation icons. Let's get back and cancel this edit. We click here. Okay. Now another thing in Safe Wallet. Okay, now we've gone. Another thing in Safe Wallet is that you can create folders in different levels. So if I want to create a new folder within my credit card folder, I hit the plus, new folder, and this will bring me to this dialog where I can set the new folder's title and icon. I enter a name, I click done, and you can see the new folder was added successfully. Let's click on it. It shows me it's empty. Okay, so let's get back to credit cards. I click edit, delete, done, and the folder is gone. Okay, so let's get back to the main folder. This is it for today. I hope you enjoyed this introduction and I wish you all a safe day with Safe Wallet. Take care.